Welcome back, everybody. The Farming Simulator 17. Here on Cherry Hill 17. Y'all are like, what are you doing, Mr. Blue? Fertilizing, folks. Fertilizing. Trying to, anyway, if I can get... There we go. Somewhat straight. Probably missing a lot, but it'd be alright. It'd be alright. We are here on field, uh, which one GPS would be in the way? Field, no, field three. I'm in the wrong pick. We are in field three, the big, big Kahuna, whatever it's called. How y'all doing today? Y'all doing alright? Oh, I'm doing just fine. Thank you for asking. Thank you for asking. Alright, we got to fertilize this field. We got to plow this field. We got field one and two. We're going to have to get planted along with field three. And uh, I'm going to square this field up, folks. I'm going to see how it zigzags through these trees. I know it's probably more realistic doing that that way, but I am uh, going to start up at the very top up there. I think. Well, it looks like to me, if I do that, it would probably work out to the best. But, I should be able to hire a worker now. I got about 20,000 left in the bucket with my fertilize spread. But, uh, look at that. My mom's on this thing already. I'm going to check, make sure she's going to turn around, and if she turns around all right, we're going to go to the next piece of equipment and just work through every piece. we got some logs to haul off too, and uh, of course, course play is going to do that, and we'll just see how this is going to go, folks. Alrighty. Alrighty. That shouldn't be too much longer. We're just about to the end. Uh, it's kind of hard to see in all this chopped straw. But you can see a little bit right there at the corner of the screen by the DPS thing there. Don't know how long this episode's going to be, folks, because I really don't have nothing planned for this. I've been trying to work on PV3. PV3. PVV3, actually. Pleasant Valley. 17 version 3 that's right folks I did get it as y'all know we're probably y'all already saw that up oh, but there's our mark all right oh 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 yep yep so far so good you see our plow marks over But we're going to spray what's in this bucket out. And then uh, we'll probably keep this thing, but we're not going to fill it back up right yet. we got some spraying to do. So, uh, yeah, let's let that do its job and let's see what's next. Okay. Whoa, seeing through the green bin. This thing needs to go to the car wash. We done got all the straw and stuff up. Dumped it in there. Uh, hey, we got a cultivator I forgot we had. I didn't get a chance to take a building out like I said I was going to, but it'd be alright. Uh, we don't have the black John Deere combine no more, I believe, because it was set in here. Uh, kind of took it out of the mods pack. But I do have another one see. Yeah, let's see though. We got the, the gravy train right there. We're gonna let it sit. Like I said, we're just gonna kinda cycle through, see where things are at. And we still have plenty of logs here, 134,523. And as you can see that it's getting ready to sell right there.
And we got our tables over here. Taffy's tables. <laughs> Getting ready to. Uh, I'm just going to take this in and uh, speed it along. Look at that money rolling in, folks. Yeah. $1,134 for a table. Wow. And I don't have my. We got 90% logs in there, so we are good up here at this one. Or, yeah, this one's at the very top up here. So, uh, I got rid of that log deal. That kind of cut down a lot of the lag. And here's our truck up here. We have three loads. Or actually, it's one load with three trailers. Um, I just cut down through here so they have a little turnaround room. So, uh, yeah. But we're going to get this guy to driving. Uh, field 1, trees to sawmill. And there's waypoint. We want to set that to first. I want to back up a little bit. Kind of get towards that point there. Actually, that's the stopping point, so drive course, stop the glass trigger. We're going to let him do his thing. I'm just going to get back over here and circle through. We still got our new Holland, both of them. Probably trading them in for some gears. Now, I said this episode we'll probably do this. As you can tell, it's fast forwarding it, and the grass didn't grow up behind me. We're going to wait a little bit to do this. Um, we'll probably just collect this grass instead of bailing it. Let's get a wind roller and a loader wagon over here. Let's check our animals are over here. I don't know if we need any straw for them or not. Um, cows can use some straw. Yep. Alright, let's go, let's go get them. This is our, uh, what was that? The 7R? We got rid of the 7930 and got a 7R up here. Hey, we got some wool. Oh, Kentucky's slipping. Oh, oh, it's slipping bad now. So I'm going to take these, put them up here. Oh, man. Still ain't quite got the hang of the bells. Watch how I end up sitting there on that wall. Stay up there till I get. There you go. I, I love this. I, I wish this was the auto load. Still kind of working on it. I haven't had a chance to mess with it. And uh, yeah. Oh my, it took all of them. Of course, we got plenty of straw bales. Once we got 20. Let's see how much. Oh, okay, it pretty much filled it up. So. That takes care of the straw. Let's go see why the Kentucky truck is sleeping. Oh, oh, that's a bad spot. I hit a tree. I hit a tree that time. Now right, we're on the nearest waypoint. Drive course. Stop the glass. There we go. Miss Patty's still doing pretty good. Now we gotta cycle back through all these again. Okay, that's it. Let's put these, uh... Let's 
this thing down so nobody get hurt. Park over here. Uh, they did need some water, didn't they? Yeah, cows are pretty low on water, so let's give them some water while we're here. I think I can hook to it with this weight on the back. It looks like it's got an electric motor on it. Uh oh. No, not gonna let me. Alright, we'll just drop the weight here. PTO shaft, so I was wrong. Oh, wrong view. There we go. That wasn't very much. I will just leave it right there. Uh, we got the other side more on this planter. We're going to probably run it out and then, uh, trade it in on another one so we're just kind of setting it right there for right now and okay, liquid fertilize and then we got the R4045 on tracks here god this thing is dirty but as soon as that buggy gets done spraying we're gonna finish it with that this is the new scorpion Oh, and uh, this is our three planters we got up here. We got the AR on this one. And our truck selling the wood. Ah. Oh yeah, big boy right here on a big drill. Hopefully, uh, next episode we'll be using these guys. Gonna use this one and I think that can plant. Yeah, sorry, being see. So yeah, field one and two is gonna be sorry, being see here. We got loaded up on fuel here. We need to take this guy around to all the uh, compost guys and fill them up. Especially with one to the farm shop. Uh, look like we're getting almost uh, a load of compost over. Drop off some fuel. Can't remember how much this thing holds. Yeah, it don't hold very much. About 30,000, yeah. Wish it hold a little bit more, but. I don't know if this trailer is full or not. Uh, almost. Oh, I'm filling myself up. Oh, there we go. I don't know if it's showing four percent. I can't get it to fill up. I had a back back under. There it goes. And okay, that's full. Compost machine's working again, so uh, drop that trailer there, and let's go get our Kentucky truck stopped. 
stop driver close that out we want to move our scorpion probably I'm not for sure we're just gonna leave this guy right here whoa oh okay he's turning around about halfway so let's go some more grass but I go the right direction yeah it doesn't fill up the poop from there we're gonna have to get the uh, solid poop I guess we're gonna have to bring a motor wagon up here and uh, I got an idea on that uh, if the trucks work we got a bob truck and we got a trailer and we just need like a uh, small terror handler or something put on the back of If it worked, uh, that's just the point, if it'll work. And liquid manure for the pigs is gone. I wish sheep would have liquid manure. At least liquid, you know, or something. Uh, we're draining our cows manure right now I thought I gave cows the water oh man I gave gave sheep the water okay I have to work on that uh, the pigs gonna need some pig food I got a truck look ready for that ah right here Let's try to get it before it Oh, Lily Gino comes back. Oh, we still got a lot left. We need like a storage thing right here. But we don't have one. Open says me. Aha! Close says me. Ha ha! Ha ha! Said the, the uh, wise man to the wiser man. I don't know, folks. I'm just making up stuff. You know, ever since I've been playing uh, PV3, trying to get it ready, I got all the fields bought. And there was like 2 million. 2.5, little 2.5 million to get all the fields, which uh, I don't need to be talking about that now. I'll be hearing all that Friday. I'll probably get sick and tired of hearing it twice. Whoa! So I'll go around back in. that dump. See, I gotta get a tractor down here with this roller. Oh yeah, that's right. We're gonna sell this thing. I forgot about that. And this plow, because we got the bigger ones. Just trying to get some of the wheels off. It, it, they say the more wheels you have, which is probably, you know, just equipment in general, you're gonna get lag, so... But, you know, I do have a lower end computer. It's... Oh, no, no, no. Oh, crap. I got cycle back to. Ah, oh, I forgot a log. You know, see that? Let's go ahead and get this thing off the, the ramp here since I jumped into it.
see what our 87% chaff and grass and 100% solid. So we need to pull out some. Okay. Okay, that'll work. But we got some bales. I'll pull under put our power I mean our, yeah our power food in here got about 140,000 43,000 well I might say 44 37 37 so it's getting kind of low and uh, we can see we got all these bales over here So we need to get our, yeah, our trailer right over there. Get a lot of these bales off of here. Yeah, this one, I should grab the long one. This trailer will work though. Like I said folks, we are going to be up doing a lot of things. And you can look right in that building right there see all that straw back there is about a load of straw right there when all this gets down we'll make some more bales uh, and those two going on there there we go two bales shine of that okay now we're going to need some more maize put in over there or pig food. Uh, okay. Might do this by hand, I don't know. It is low. Why didn't it take? Sellage. Six thousand liters. Don't you row, don't you row, you stay right there. Oh, this bell is heavy. Shiny too. There it goes. Why didn't it take with the truck? Ah, wrong spot. I think it filled it up. If not, it came pretty close. Close enough. And we'll get a little grasshopper running around collecting grass. There. Go ahead and get the straw out of the barn. Put a few bells in there. And we can't forget about our pigs. I mean, our cows. Yeah, I might need to back in. Test my backing skills out. Folks, if y'all just witnessed some bagging, uh, I'm sorry. It, it's showing a uh, encoder overloading, whatever that means. First time I ever got a, a warning like that. All right, I gotta switch this to bales. 
I just run into them and look like it. Square barrel. Work position. Come on. Got one back there trying to float on me. swing. Yeah, that barn's empty too. Think about taking both those barns out. There's like a parking lot here for the semi-trucks. I don't know. Or try to take the uh, doors off the back so I can drive through them. Super train. I think I got full that time. Might need to, uh. I'm just gonna leave these on the trailer, but I won't park right here for right now. This is looking. We need to get those plows going. That's still looking good. Oh yeah, didn't miss no spot. See, I ain't worried about that one little thumb looking deal on the side there because we're going to take that out. So yeah, it's looking pretty good. I'll tell you what, I'm on. We're gonna drop that there. We're gonna drop that there. We're gonna try to unsqueeze ourselves out of here. I should have watched it real quick, but we gotta get these uh, plows going. We ain't gonna be able to plant. And I was gonna check on the fertilization on the field two and one. Should be ready to plant. ground, laid grass, yes, this on the first pass, so I was wanting to go over this a little bit more, but I got thinking, you know, I'll just keep it like this, but we'll bring the scorpion, this is where we're going to bring the scorpion, we're going to take these trees out from the shop over, down to here, and then probably a scorpion width wide let's get my GPS pulled up here uh, we're going to auto then rotate then scoopy doop doop about right there turn our tracker on we're going to pull up a little bit and Actually, I need to scoot over just a little bit more. We're going to take a tree out, so I'm going to scoot about right there. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to drive it this first time just to see what it's going to be. What do y'all think? Let's take a little drive down through. 
So come out like that. I may have to turn this, I'm not for sure. Can't go too fast with the GPS on. Alright. We're about 30 minutes in. This shouldn't take too long. I'm trying to figure out exactly how much ground I'm going to lose by doing that. You know, we gain all that on field one and two. And I'm thinking that this will sit like I need to rotate it just a little bit. If I need to get a plow marker and go by a plow marker. We're going to be losing a lot of. We could cut all those trees and get us some farm ground there. But there's a, there's a factory down here. I see a road. Oh, don't, 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 don't. Yeah, see, there's a. Yeah, so we're going to leave that alone. It'll be getting, you know, more L shapes in it. So I think it will work out about right. Yeah, that's that's gonna work out about right. I just gonna see one, two. Oh man, I done. Which one was it? Was it that? I think it was this. Yeah, I think it was this one right here. I hope. Anyway, here we go. And it's going to go to the right a little bit. But that give us more grass. We'll uh, be able to mow that with the the grasshopper will set a clear the trees out and we'll set a course play for it. But this is what I'm going to do with this, folks. Uh, I'm going to go find the plows real quick. Where are they? Uh, my shift should be three. Oh, big bud, right on the money. Now see, I think if I keep it like that, it's going to be square to see how, how it is right there. I can get that little corner right there. That's going to be overkill right there, but yeah, that'll work. Yeah, I'm going to scoot. I'm going to do the ends real quick. Alright, Boo's going to be driving the big bug. Ah, right, I got up here. I'm going to sell this thing. We got enough pallets. We got enough pallets. All right, so we're almost to two million. Right, let's go back to her. A big boy plow here. She's driving that. Come 
Come on, boo. Turn around. There we go. Now we'll probably plant it like we did last time. I don't know. We're going to get bigger combines. I, I know the 100,000 liter combine on grill, but these are some big fields, so. Right, I'm going to just let them work like that. He's done. Let's see if we got any corn in here. Oh, yeah. I'll get about, I don't know, 30,000 maybe, maybe a little more of corn. Just for right now. But yeah, I, uh, I was supposed to tell y'all about my little trip last week. I'm actually recording this on Monday. Y'all be seeing it on Wednesday. Uh, can you think what the day is? What is today? Today is 25th, Monday. September 25th, Monday. That's enough right there. It's not going to hold a hundred thousand. I mean, hundred thousand. All this is going to hold. Um, like I said last week, I had to go to the doctor a couple days, and uh, you know, got some blood work drawn, and uh, went back, got my results, and come find out that not only am I diabetic and high blood pressure, I got cholesterol now. And there was something else she said that was real high and my iron's real low. So I'm like, great, I'm anemic now. And uh, so I'm all messed up in that area. Alright, we got corn here. Sunflower's okay and potatoes are okay. So this thing should start making pig food here in a minute. So that's taken care of. This guy's running. That's taking care of. Need some more grass. So, uh, he's full, so that'd be all right for right now. Um, we're just gonna park this guy out of the way for right now. We need to go check on my mom here. Here. I, I think she's gonna have enough in here to finish this whole thing. I just might have to spray across the ends. So, so that that's not bad, folks. It's not bad. Let's go on over here, getting our tractor, and we're going to uh, go on down through here. I wish I could go a little bit faster. I really do. And folks, I'm gonna have to buy some. I'm gonna buy a deal that hooks up two rollers. Y'all probably saw it Sunday on uh, Upper Mississippi River Rally. It's it's just a blue blue deal that has uh, two three point hitch things on it. It's for a cultivator, but you can hook other things to it. You can hook two tree planters plant trees with two machines at one time I, I might do that but not on this not on this series because we got a lot of trees here yeah we might do it on uh, I don't know you can plant poplars too uh, get the popular planter just like the tree planter but it's poplars in a pallet there you're gonna 
you know, hook both of them together, plant like that. Even, uh, in my case, you hook two rotors to it. Now, you have to adjust the rotors a certain way for it to fold up right or it get a little jumpy. But other than that, uh, you put both rotors down on the ground and have gravel or cement, asphalt, whatever you want. So it's pretty neat. Now I do have uh, two more maps. The West Coast and Plains and Simple. Plains and Simple. Uh, Plains and Simple is by Stevie. I can't remember what West Coast is by. Uh, oh, Blue is blocked by Object. Stop. Betsy's there, the words. Oh my god, boo. No. Oh, this really don't matter. I don't know where it's going to quite come out at. It should come out even under grass, but just to make sure. Alright, Boo's doing pretty good. Uh, like I said, we probably just plow this whole thing and then come in here with the planters, have like three planters going in a row or something like that. J Boo decided to drive. Okay, okay, that'll work. Uh, we need to get these washed up. We're probably going to trade that combine in. Uh, we are full here, so there are cows needed. They do, but we're going to wait a little bit. Just trying to get a bunch of stuff in storage so we get more cows, get more milk. Milk, it does a body great or good. I miss those old milk commercials. Of course, I don't watch very much TV anymore, but. Uh, got milk. It was, remember those commercials? Let's see. This is done. This, uh, there's our water trough for the cows. Open says May. Open before I said it. Um, da, 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 da. Yeah, we gotta go up here. Oh, oh I got pull. Whoa, whoa! A pig and a sheep's been born. Sorry, dude. I'm gonna side swipe you. Pig and a sheep has been born. All right. They're trying to double up on me. That auto save scares me every time, folks. But anyway, I do have two, you know, two extra maps that I haven't played yet. Now I thought about doing a live stream, on one of them, but I really don't know what's the best night. Uh, or should I do it during the day? Be best on me during during. <laughs> doing it during the day because the kids are in school I wish I had another computer uh, another I, I wish I had a gaming computer and give this computer I got now to my son that way me and him both can play farming simulator uh, his laptop he's got won't be close to it won't even play Minecraft so I know it won't handle this and all the mods alright oh. alright we are draining into this little hole right here with the blue blades and see it filling up there and folks what's this going to do with this straw and the liquid poop 
it's going to make solid manure. So uh, that will help us with our compost and stuff. Um, actually, yeah, I want to drop most of his fuel to the one at the shop. So we go on down there real quick. Now, I don't know, I'm pretty sure there ain't very many that watches my videos all the way through. Might be a few of y'all out there, and I really appreciate that. I really, 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 really do. Um, oh, folks, time y'all see this, I should, I really, really, really should be over 10,000 views. And I'm almost to 500 videos. I got like, uh, it's Monday for me, and I'm like at 451, 452 videos. So, yeah. I'm at 257 subscribers. But, uh, yeah, time y'all, well, tonight. Uh, September 25th, I think that's what I said. I will be, uh, should be right at 10,000 views. I, I got like 80, 89 views left from being from 10,000. So I'm so excited on that. Maybe I'll start getting some uh, revenue coming in. But they say it's going to take about a week, though. They're going to review my channel and stuff like that. I'm like, yeah, I've been reviewing my channels from the get-go, you know? Keep forgetting it's... Um... This thing full. This only hold 5,000. I mean, uh, I got one notch from. Is I not getting a uh, refill trigger on this one? It's not running for some reason. Ah. Got 200,000. Maybe it's not running because it's full. Ah, that's probably what it is. I need to get the. Uh... Oh, I... Yeah, I got a truck right over here. Dang, all this time I thought it was out of fuel and it was just full. Shame on me. Uh oh, Betsy's completed her task. Let's go check on it real quick. Oop. Uh, I think it was this one. Yeah, she almost made it to the time. You get this little spot right here. Ah, uh, 
on my beautiful truck. All right. Let's see if we can unload a little bit more grass here. Yay, we're empty. Right, folks, this is up by that. Well, we're about middle of the screen there. You see the animal. I don't know why there's a fuel symbol out in Bill 11 for. But uh, we need to get down here. This 31% digestate. Which we can get a tanker and bring over here. So we got a bunch of solid fertilizer. And that makes liquid fertilizer too. That's showing a zero. But it's not. Is it right? Sound like it is. No, it's not running. It's empty. So it's like I got the liquid fertilizer out. Let's go like this. Jay Boo still doing pretty good. Uh, eh, eh, crap. Hmm. Right, control W. And we're just going to drive this just a little bit more because I'm curious where it's going to come out at. I wish you could hire a worker. But it'd be alright. Oh, folks, our iron's just about up. Oh, my goodness. Goodness, my goodness, my goodness. Time flies when you're having fun. We go out when the sun comes on out. It is gloomy. I always hated gloomy days when I was driving a tractor in real life. I worked for uh, Fred Austin's son, which is Vance, at, uh, at uh, 8400 John Deere. Uh, it's uh, well, like one of the first series of 8400 when they come out, you know, it's a brand new tractor. It had maybe four hours on it, and that was just from demo and stuff. Well, not really demo, but you know, people go out on the lot and stuff, start it, they move it around and stuff like that. Uh, I think they said it was sitting on the lot for about two months and uh, Vance leased it. Uh, I loved that tractor. Four wheel drive, duels on the back. Uh, done pretty much a lot of stuff with it. Cut stalks cotton stalks with it um, and one thing about it is my tractor you can put what you want on it you know I had a spot for one of those John Deere black toolboxes I put tools in it locked it up I had a thing under the seat we can put tools I put my special tools in that and um, but yeah I, I miss working like that I, I was the foreman there for about a year. I worked there for about two years. Um, the first year, probably about the first nine months, you know, I started working out with a sea monkey. Oh, missed this spot. Right, check that out. I was a seed monkey. I was loading planters and stuff for him. And I was like, well, let's show me what all do you know. And I'm like, well, give me a little time. I can do everything. So I, I basically done it all for him. Uh, oh, that's a spot. But uh, yeah, uh, hipped up cotton rows. Oh man, another spot. That ain't good. Hipped up cotton rows, planted, thrash, pig cotton. Um. Uh, so the next year, the foreman that. Where it was in charge, he he left, and they're like, "Well, do you want this spot?" Like you basically 
doing it, everything now as it is, you know. And, uh, so yeah, I basically worked there for a year as a, you know, about two years total, maybe a little over two years. And that's when I got down in my back and I had to had to quit there. Went to work at Walmart after that. Big change. Big, big, big change. That was, oh no. I'll have to fix that. Stay straight, stay straight, stay straight. Yes. All right, folks. Um, I think I'm gonna buy me another track. Like I got enough, right? I'm gonna go ahead and do this before I end the episode. That way, y'all know. See what I'm doing. Make it quicker. Um, I don't know what happened to my 4960. So that just goes to 49.55, but it says I got a 49.60. I, I thought I had one. Got the uh, uh, 44.40. I need to try to find the 48.40. It's right down here. Um, I tell you what, folks, we. I ain't had a track tractor yet, so it's not very much sentence to that. So it's uh, that, and, and then that's the biggest. Almost half a million. We're gonna get it. Yes. Okay. Now I'm gonna show you this sudden over here. Uh, oh, it's got Green Star. Green Star is just that little bubble right up there. That's an 8370. So, it's a whole lot bigger. Oh, crap. Why did I do that for? You got a... Uh, Colorators. We're going to buy this thing right here. And I'm going to go on over mis miscellaneous. Now we're going to pick blue. We're going to buy. Yes. Okay. Oh, that moved off. Yes. Okay. And I'm going to hop out and switch over to the new 9RT series. Look at that gorgeous baby. Check the inside. Inside pretty much simple. Got the buddy seat. It's just nice. And boy does it got the power. And I drove a John Deere track tractor and a cat tracker and I prefer the cat tracker itself it, it just of course when we had it was a baby John Deere you know it was, it was equivalent to like a 81 or 8200 John Deere alright there we go and that's it, folks. Uh, right B and down does it like that. Now, it looks like it might be touching the ground, but it's not touching the ground. And then all you have to do is, you know, that is on original ground, remove grass. Yes, I don't want it to remove grass. And then switch to the other roller. Original ground, remove grass. No. Uh, 
oh crap, I just changed it. Original ground. Remove grass, no. Switch. Original ground, remove grass, no. And then switch back to that. Well, I don't. Switch to that. Right B and B. And then switch to the right B and B. And then switch to your one next to your tractor and just hit B. LB and B. Lowers it all down. And every once in a while to switch over, you know, make sure the original ground, original ground, and back to the main. And that's how you do that, folks. And uh, hold it up. A little slow, but it's, it's getting there. And when I tilted the rotors back, it, it shouldn't jump right here. Yep, yeah, it's going to. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I forgot. It's uh, LB and up on your right stick. Does it like that? Yeah, there you go. Does it like that? It won't be bumping or nothing. So folks, I'm going to go do a little bit of work on that. I'm not going to do much because i got to record a couple more. And, uh, yeah. So, thank you for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed this. Those vehicles coming. Oh. And, um, yeah. Stay tuned uh, until, you know, tomorrow. I'll we'll have another episode on uh, Shenetitans tomorrow. Yeah. Then, Bethesda Valley V3 Friday. So stay tuned, folks. And uh, we'll see you later, okay? Once again, thank you for watching. Please leave a comment. Hit that like button. Share me if you want to. And uh, I'll see you later, folks. Bye.